What's going on YouTube, Geosnorite here, so in today's video I have great news for those of you who want to customize their device on iOS 16.4, 16.5, 16.3.1 16 and even 16.0 and stuff like that. Kawabunga Lite was released, which allows you to customize the theme, icons, status bar and stuff like that without a jailbreak. More on that in a second. This video is brought to you by iMyPhone NE2, which allows you to change your location with one click. You just select the location on the map, press move and press move again here and that's it. Your device is is now believing that it is indeed on that location. You can also set up multiple paths that your device should follow, you can set up the speed that your device should travel at and of course this will be emulated on your device and you can use this for gaming reasons, for playing Pokemon Go and for social media and even to protect your privacy online. Definitely check this location changer down below, it doesn't require a jailbreak and it does support iOS 16 as well. So a couple of hours ago the developer of Kawabunga finally released the Kawabunga Lite version 1.0 which is basically working on all iOS 16 versions on all devices. It does support the latest devices like the iPhone 10 10s, 10 10R, 11, 12, 13 and stuff like that and it works on all iOS 16 versions no matter how new the version is. Now this has been in development since April. Back in April we posted this article in here, Kawabunga Lite coming soon, tweaks and themes for iOS 16.0 up to 16.5 without a jailbreak and it finally came out. It's been in beta on Patreon for a while but now it's finally a available and in order to get it you just have to go here on github on Kawabunga Lite and for the moment you need a Mac running Mac OS 11.0 Big Sur or higher or of course it can be a virtual machine as well an iOS device running iOS 15.0 or newer and find my iPhone must be turned off while applying and these are all the tweaks that it supports quite a few it doesn't support as many tweaks as the normal Kawabunga from iOS 16.1.2 and lower because that one is based on the Mac 30 Cow exploit but still this one allows you to install themes and to customize your device with some minor jailbreak tweaks even without a jailbreak whatsoever. So once you get it the application looks like this. You connect your device as you can see 15.7.5 is supported but it works on 16 as well and then you can go here to explore tab and you can download themes and stuff like that. As you can see over here there are a couple of themes. You can go with status bar theming which if you enable is going to give you a couple of options in here to select data type and stuff like that. Uh, show numeric cellular strength, show numeric Wi-Fi strength and stuff like that, hide the Wi-Fi icon, the cellular icon, the battery, whatever. So you can do a lot of stuff in there, springboard options in here like disable lock after respring, disable screen dimming, disable low battery alerts, show known Wi-Fi networks, show Wi-Fi debugger, set airdrop to everyone, UI animation speed and lock screen footnote and stuff like that. And then you have a couple of setup options in here like disable OTA updates, enable supervision and even skip setup and stuff like that. So you can easily apply those by pressing apply in there and that's basically it. So Kawabunga Lite is now available, definitely check it out in the link below, as I said you can do a lot of stuff considering the fact that this doesn't require a jailbreak at all and it does support all devices including the newer ones. I'm going to leave a link in the description down below so definitely check it out but it's a good customization platform for those of you who are not jailbroken but waiting for a jailbreak. Thank you for watching, I'm Geosnow, till the next time, peace out.